Named after the original cup-winning Senators, this team looks to bring back winning traditions to the Canadian capital of Ottawa. Greetings, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, Mike Emmerich, right before game time here. It's an interesting sport in that sometimes your star players only play a third of the time. Do they ever make a contribution? Though? Well, you need them, Doc, to make those big contributions. Star players are a real important cog to the success of your team because if you don't have a lot of them, you're not going to have much success. Suter's versatility, Doc, is what makes him a special player. Look for him to be front and center throughout this game. Okay, so let's look at the starting goaltenders for the game. Craig Anderson gets the call to the crease. Park Ridge, Illinois, over a decade in the NHL, never gave up. He was claimed on waivers three times in two months at 25 and didn't get his big chance till he joined the Colorado Avalanche at age 29. Devin Dubnik, his first ever victory as a wild goalie was a 7-0 shutout. And that was the first of 38 straight he played. He won 27. What a start. Eric Stahl, twice a 40-goal scorer with Carolina and a Stanley Cup winner. He also had Olympic gold for Canada and a career rebirth after a move to Minnesota. This contest is underway in Ottawa. You could almost count that one, but no. Pitching it to Stone. Snapping a pass to Spurgeon. Nice play with the stick. Nothing more will come. Oh, broke it up. And it is icing called on this play, and so we'll have a face-off all the way back. A little under three minutes play. Nothing on the scoreboard has changed. Still a pair of zeros. On to Duchesne. Passing one off now to Shabbat. Slid to Stone. With no time whatsoever, he turned it aside. That was a tougher stop than a look. Terrific determination by Eric Stahl. Has that one measured in his own end. Let's it go. Terrific glove save. Holds on and gets that whistle. An American-born player, Zach Parise, signed with the Minnesota Wild on Independence Day, the 4th of July. What's best about him? He's the farthest thing from an individual player. He is a total team player. He plays in every situation. He plays with that nose-over-the-puck mentality. A dogged player. Zach Parise. Directing that one to Zingle. In with it now. And he is reefed. He's certainly on a mission out there. He's trying to set a tone for his team in what should be a really physical contest. What a terrific save. And he shoots. Got the save there. To Pajo. Has it picked up. Shoots that pass ahead. It's all on his shoulders. That shot came from right in front. The shooter thought he had a chance, but the goaltender robs him. What a stop. Nice save there. They're going to have to do better than that to beat him. The Senators in their own end controlling play now. Well, we can only hope that the game picks up in pace here. One on one. A breakaway stop there. Minnesota's in their own end hoping to make a play to center. Brings it in for an attack. Good shooting place. Score! Always better to play from in front than to chase the game. There's the game's first goal. So he played a while in this period, and finally, a goal. I was hoping, Doc, that we were going to get that first one. Minnesota's got possession from the faceoff. 
Linesman signals an offside. And by number 29, Greg Hatterin. Time of the goal, 13 minutes, 52 seconds. A little under six minutes to be played. It's a 1-0 game. The Senators with a win at center. Takes it in from the neutral zone. Snags the puck. Minnesota's forced another turnover in this very close game. And he is shooting. Oh, a save there. The Senators have control of the puck at center ice. Fires. Score. And the game is even. You get the lead, you want to pin the lead down. You want to give yourself the opportunity to spread the lead out. But they don't. They give up the tying goal. And now we're back to even. The Senators control from the neutral zone. By number 89, Mikel Bodker. Gains that offensive line. By number 41. Scooped up by Felino. Minnesota's in their own end and controlling play now. Clock loose now picked up. Pitching this one to Duchesne. He gets through. In the first period. A shot. He got a piece of that one. Equal to the challenge. Nice stop. Chip to Shabbat. Such a good stick. That could have been held by a Canadian of the 70s. 20 minutes in the books and a lot more hockey to be played. Both teams have connected one time. One one after one. Do you want the assurance of knowing you have a ticket to all the big games? Then grab our season tickets. Guarantee your seat for the upcoming playoffs. Senators got this goal late in the period and that tied the game. So they are on an upswing as we go to break. Period number two has started. Fans settling back into their seats. And the first play may spring the tie-breaking goal. Nicely received at the point. He turned it. Minnesota's setting things up in their own end. Zucker's tripped up. That should be a penalty. And now we get the stoppage of play in the penalty call. Ottawa's only going to get two minutes on this call, but it was tripping. Well, in desperation mode, all he was trying to do was sweep the puck away, but unfortunately caught the player's skates. Minnesota's power play will have its first chance of the game. Oh, you get your power play on the ice for the first time. You can really generate some momentum whether you score or not. Have a positive power play. Ottawa's gotten it back out. They check the clock, get ready to defend. Minnesota starting back in the defensive zone. Can start the attack going in the zone. He got his glove on that one. Got that pass near the blue line and now looks ahead. Broke it right up. Terrific glove save. That shift was looking really dangerous with all that pressure. The goalie finally got possession. He freezes the puck to slow things down. Anderson's lucky. He just got a piece of that, but it was enough to make the stop. That's a solid face-off win. He's got it, but has to get rid of it. The Senators shoot it back out. Got some time to check the clock and prepare to defend again. Ottawa's killed it off, and we're back even. Let's it go. At least he protected his goaltender. A shot. 
Lots of pressure right now. They've got to break that. Propel to Borowicki. Looking to Pajo. And the whistle signals an offside. They win the draw and will now set up an attack. Quick shot. Hit the post with the shot. I'd say this game has played out pretty much according to plan. Both teams have been really focused on the defensive side of the puck. There's not much. Alone. He scores. Two straight goals. There's been a number of close chances here at either end as this continued tie game strung out. Now they've got the lead. We'll see where it takes us now. The Senators have taken the lead by one. What fork in the road are we headed for with this faceoff? They've got the draw. Minnesota's in the neutral zone along the way. Turned away with the stick. Just walking the tightrope. Good place to shoot from. And that pass is a mess, and so they're going to have to go back out. Solid work there by Brodie. Minnesota's in control of the puck up the wing. Fires. That hits somebody. A shot. Solid glove save. The low shot's handled with the goaltender's stick. He deflects this out of danger in a hurry. Solid face-off win. He throws it there. Score! And this one is tied! Well, I guess this game's not going to spread out. That goal ties it. The teams are so evenly matched. A little over seven minutes still showing on the clock this period. The red light has flashed four times to a side. And he steps in. Shoots. Oh, what a save. He brought his best shot, and it got stopped. A solo rush. Save. Couldn't have handpicked a better guy to be on a breakaway, and he stopped him. And the pickup. Otto is up the wing, setting things up. Outstanding body contact. Suter's ability around the league is eye-catching, but when he uses the body, everybody takes note. Flings it. Score! Man, they're excited here. They've broken the tie. They've got the lead. But now you have to concentrate and get right back down to work. Minnesota's broken the tie late in the second period, setting the stage for a wonderful conclusion to this and then a full third period ahead. And they are in. Made the same. That puck is held, and the whistle stops the play. 17 minutes, 11 seconds. Good job on the draw. Moving it to CeCe. Ottawa's moving the puck up the wing. 
Players tired, about to get a rest. Seconds to play here, still in the second period. And he steps across the line. Not too difficult a shot to stop. And he holds on and stops playing. Defensive zone win. <laughs> Two periods are in the books here, and so one more to go, and maybe overtime. But it's been an entertaining first two. We take a look at the shots on goal through two periods. 15 for the Wild and 9 for the Senators. Stay warm and stylish in the ring with our specially priced item tonight, our game team scarf. Parisi's goal has made the difference so far, but is it the winner? Intermission time is here. Forty minutes have been played. They are getting ready for the third period here. So take us back through the game. What do you think, Eddie? Ottawa's a bounce away from getting right back in this game. One area of concern has been their time of possession. They have not had the puck a lot in this game. Picks it up in his own end. Pass attempt to Stone. Puck is thrown to Duchesne. Breaks away. He scores! Duchesne! We came into the game, guys, thinking these teams were evenly matched. Now we've played some of this contest, and here we are, back at a stalemate. And that's a face-off win. Trying to go to Stone. It's just him. Stands his ground on the breakaway. Now it's directed to Parisi. Steals that pass at center. One minute, 47 seconds. Laid on to Ryan. A shot. Lightning in that glove. Minnesota's looking to head man up the wing. Save! He's in on an onside play. Takes a shot. Great save. Pitching it to Zucker. Terrific determination by Duchesne. Solid neutralized poke check. And he sends it to the net. Deflected off the blocker. Ottawa's organizing back in the defensive zone. Wow, what force in that one. That's a great hit. He thought he had more room to get down the wall, and he got closed off in a hurry. I'm not so sure any of the coaches want this game to be played like it is, but there is no slowing the scoring down. There's been great goals, bad goals, and a few in between. Steps in from the neutral zone. He wore that puck on a hard shot. He left his feet, but not on his own, and not by choice. Skill play by Coyle. Good, solid defensive play with the stick. Things are heating up with that hit. Ottawa's along the wing at center ice. To Sealer. Snapping a pass to Erickson Eck. Good place to shoot. He had it past the goalie, but not past the iron. Outstanding job done at the blue line to hold the pressure on. Let's a shot go. That puck flopped over the glass and landed in one of the rows near the glass, and a fan from Fumble, Pennsylvania, has come up with a souvenir. Oh. 
And they've taken that face off between the blue lines and won it. Flings it. They score! What a quick answer to that one. The next little bit will be crucial. Now that they've got the lead, how do they play with it? Minnesota's gotten the lead here, breaking the tie in the third period. What a raucous ride to the finish we're going to have now. And the faceoff's won. Scored by number 36. Nick Gains the zone. By number 11, Zach a superb hit. A great hockey play there. I like that he's trying to create space by throwing the body around. This is a way to change momentum in a hockey game. He's got it there. He wants to clear it out. We are in the last minute. Save there. Smart recovery by Whiteman. Passing one off now to Duchesne. Shoots it off. Perfect tip by the stick. The Senators have to take a chance here. They pull their goalie. Skilled play by Eric Stahl. He's headed the other way. Maybe a little greedy here with the empty net. He went for it from his side to center. He missed, and now the faceoff will come down into his zone. Ryan's been in discomfort since this hit here. The cage is vacant. Chance taking time. So important to win the next face off now. They win the draw. Let's see if it pays off. That puck struck him in front. Good job of clearing. Minnesota's defensive play has been flawless here as of late. Those are good plays just to get it out of the zone. On to Pajot. Up to the point. Tremendous hit. And the puck's cleared out, and that will do it. The horn sounds the end of this game. The Senators have lost a close game. Their goaltender is tired. He should be. Lots of rubber towards his net. This was a lot closer than it should have been. Terrific contest. Two teams gave their very best. See you next time.